I heard a thing. You know, there's like, you always hear about um, Vigo Morganson. He does loads of nice things. Yeah. He's a cool guy. It's one of indie grand. One of the cool guy things he did was um, one of the stunt women was like uh, doing horse stuff, and um, she really wanted to like buy the horse afterwards because it wasn't her horse. And one of the like studio executives was like, "Nope, that I want that horse. I'm buying it. It's mine." Um, when they, they did like a weird auction for like loads of the stuff after the thing. Okay. And so Vigo Morganson like. Pay, like paid double the price of the studio executive and then gave it to the the stunt woman had it had it stuffed <laughs> and taxidermy and like hey i know i heard you now, love this horse now you can keep it forever keep it forever <laughs> and then she bursts into tears he's like please but like i'm just so generous <laughs> you don't look she look she's crying and she, happy she's speechless she's speechless yeah <laughs> now take it away uh, Wow. Oh. Okay. Vigo. Vigo, what a boy. <laughs> Look how little Sly Demiser is. Oh, can you... <laughs> wow, he's <laughs> so small. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely minuscule. Why? Why is he so small? Is he very small or is Orc very big? <laughs> he is a really tiny little boy. <laughs> I think it's just, just him. Everyone else is pretty big. <laughs> Holy shit. Can he, can That's he... got to be a bug with the spider. Right? Yeah, I guess like it has has a footprint and just the model scales to that because the spider's quite wide. Why don't take him off the spider? What can the I hell? do that? Uh... Okay, he gets, he gets like a little bigger, but he's still, <laughs> a bit bigger. he's still pretty, pretty mini. Oh my god, this is the secret of how he killed Carl Franz. Wow. Just snuck in. Oh my god, he fucking um, ant man into his bum hole. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay. Right. Straight past that armor of meteoric iron. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and just went in, got off his spider, and just <laughs> blam! Just burst out of him. Okay. Oh, I don't know which part's worse, the dying or having the spider up your ass. Mm. Probably the dying. Yeah, do you want to live with spiders in your butt? No. Sometimes no. dead is better. <laughs> Sometimes dead is better. Uh, Red wine of Whitehall. Uh, thanks for the 15 bucks. Oh, thank uh, you. They say, Tam and Ben. Uh, I only have limited time to watch today. Oh, no. As grad school starts today. Oh. And I've been studying. It's really crimping on my I'm actually very lazy style. Oh, uh, that those, those don't match. Uh, the plan is to get the credentials now, so I can be lazy for longer later. Oh my that, god! That is big brain thinking. Like little bit of work now for more laziness That's later. That's not is very that... lazy thinking, though. Or is it the most lazy? Mm. Who's better at being lazy? The person who has to keep doing the little person bits who's of work. lazy right now. Is that better? That's the ultimate in laziness. Even though it's worse. I don't know, because if you if if you're lazy right now, mm. but you're gonna have to do stuff tomorrow, then you can be lazy the next day, and then you have to do more stuff and you have to keep oh topping up so you can be lazy. Mm. But if you do like a week's worth of stuff now, and then you can be lazy for like a month. <gasps> well then he's not the laziest yet. He will be later. Yeah. But not today. That's that's true. I'm the lazy one today. Okay. You could be the lazy one today, <laughs> but soon. Lazy, don't think ahead. That's not the lazy way. <laughs> that isn't the lazy way. Um, productively lazy. He will be. He will be much lazier. But not today. Be strong. Good luck. What do people do at grad school? Uh, they graduate and they learn how to graduate. Yeah, like what, yeah. you like practice like throwing your little hat in the air. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Give uh, little speeches. Take the take the scroll. Mm -hmm. Like walk down the steps without like. Fucking up, falling over. <laughs> yep, yep. Don't trip over your long robe. Yeah. It's um, hard work, man. Okay. Yeah, you don't want to fuck that up. Oh, God. Embarrassing. Everyone's taking photos. Oh, how embarrassing. Uh, Hanky Panky, one, two, three, four. Uh, thank you for the 10 bucks. It's very mm -hmm. kind. Thank you. Um, and they say, slowly morphing into Simon Tom and Ooh. great value brand Lewis Ben. I am great uh, value. 
And yeah, you know, my dream. My dream is to be Simon one day. Don't we all want to be like uh, Simon? You know, hollow him, hollow him out. Take his skin and wear <laughs> Oh, it. just live inside him. That's right. Oh, that's sexy. Uh, Lethys has also donated. Thank you Lethys. very much. They say, Tom Ben, could I please get your best Belagar Iron Hammer impression? You can click on him for an example. He basically shouts his name, and my friend and I think it's funny. Also can be heard in the diplomacy screen. Mm. Oh, I like ghosts. <laughs> my ghosts watch me wank. They watch me wank. <laughs> very, very Simon-esque. <laughs> it's a bit of a Simon Iron Hammer. Belagar Iron Hammer. Belagar Iron Hammer. Belagar Iron Hammer. <laughs> Belagar Iron Hammer. <laughs> Belagar Iron Hammer. <laughs> He's just going like dumber and dumber. Uh, I want to live in Caragain Pink. <laughs> I live in Caragain Pink. <laughs> My name's Belagar, and I'm a big, big idiot. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, watch me, puppy. That's the ghost. Ghost friend. <laughs> uh, she's no. Um, do it's ten bucks each, isn't it? Thank you. Um, and they say, uh, ten and bomb. Long time stream goblin. First time donator. Ooh. Um, Immortal Empires is the most fun I've had in the total war uh, in a while. Ooh. I really hope that the Warriors of Chaos upgrade mechanic becomes a thing for every faction. Oh, uh, that would be game fun. going forward. Uh, love you guys. Keep being cool. Um, the it's such a cool idea. Yeah, it's really fun. Um, so if anyone doesn't know how it works, you can have a unit of Marauders, mm -hmm. and as they uh, level up. Um, and for a little bit of money, they can become kind of like chaos warriors, then chosen, or knights, and they can or chaos whatever. Knights, and then mm -hmm. doom riders, and um, that's really fun. Especially once you start naming all your units. Yeah, I think it would be so good for, especially like how we play, mm. that you can have a pleb unit of gobos go all the way up to becoming, like, yeah, like squig riders or whatever. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. Looking forward to trying it out. Um, chaos mechanics wouldn't make sense for. Most other factions, I think you could kind of make it work with like Depends. Gobos going up to becoming yeah, Night, night goblins. goblins or something like yeah. that. As long as they're uh, careful with it and they don't turn Gobos into Orcs and stuff and Skinks uh, into Saurus. Yeah, yeah, like, but having your Saurus, you could upgrade them to become Temple Guard. Um, mm. Things along those lines. It doesn't have to be, you know, a unit of Skinks can eventually become a, a fucking old blood riding <laughs> Carnosaur. Like, don't need yeah. that. Um, <laughs> Yeah, it'd be fun. Oh, it'd make perfect sense for Protonia. You know, your knights of errant turned into realmers who turn into questers who turn into grail knights. That'd be really cool. That'd be awesome. Yeah, you wouldn't want peasants to upgrade and become grail knights. No. That would... Maybe they could turn into battle pilgrims. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like peasants turning into battle pilgrims. Maybe they could become a grail relic. Mm. Um, peasants into footmen. Yeah, peasants yeah. into footmen. Like, if you have the choice of, like, they can become footmen or uh, battle pilgrims. Bam. Mm -hmm. One or the other. They kind of do different different jobs. Mm. Um, like Mountain Blade. Yeah, I just want the Mountain Blade mechanics. I just think a bit of um, Gobble Watchers turning into Night Gobbos. Yeah, um, that's fun. Because then if there's a way that you don't necessarily have to have those buildings to start out with or something like that, or maybe you do need it somewhere in your empire, but it just means that you can get some like wackier units in your armies. And it also means like your starting army gets really high experience, mm. but then you're kind of like, well, I want my newer units now. Yeah, and so you kind of just like ditch. And being able to carry that experience over, that'd Wouldn't be cool. Be great. Oh, oh, dear Vlad. Vlad. Why why are you gotta be like this, Vlad Vlad? Vlad Mav. Why don't you focus on all of these wars you have? What the fuck also, <laughs> contracts with the dead are always invalid. Oh wow, that's his get out of jail free card. For oh the... you didn't really have a deal with me. Looking dead. I'm, I'm dead. I'm dead. Doesn't count. Valid invalid. <laughs> um <laughs> Does he ring up his self like phone plan and just go, I'm ending my contract because no. I'm dead. I'm dead. Contract <laughs> over. <laughs> fuck you. Um Wow, thanks, Vlad. Wow, what a prick. Uh, okay. Get lawyered. Yeah. What a jerk. <laughs> if the coffin doesn't fit, you must acquit. <laughs> God. Think of all those checks he's written. 
Oh, yeah. Every every store in the empire has do not accept checks from this man. <laughs> yeah, the picture on glass. <laughs> it's like, ooh. ooh. <laughs>